senators debated and passed the Prescription Drug Monitoring Act. Senate Bill 74 requires the Department of Health and Senior Services to develop and maintain a statewide program to track the prescribing and dispensing of all Schedule 2 through 4 controlled substances. Under the legislation, a medical provider would first enter the patient's information into the drug database. If there is reason for concern according to the database, the provider could then access the patient's prescription history before issuing the prescription. This is a good faith attempt to find a compromise that will meet the needs of the prescribers, cut down on drug diversion, identify doctor shoppers, and get this issue behind us. The legislation includes several security safeguards intended to protect the patient's personal information. Currently, Missouri is the only state in the nation without a prescription drug monitoring program. However, not everyone supports the legislation. One lawmaker believes it forces health care providers to jump through too many hoops before issuing a prescription. When we force them to take extra steps, sometimes it means that in a busy doctor's office, you may not do what you need to do, and we may overlook, um, we may overlook some possibilities of people who have, again, come here to doctor shop in order to access the opioids, or we may leave a patient in harm's way. Lawmakers approved the proposal by a 20 to 13 vote. It now heads to the Missouri House of Representatives for consideration. Reporting from the state capitol, I'm Jonathan Lorenz.